Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel once again with another new vlog that is 5th or 6th vlog. I hope you are all doing great. So in this vlog, I want to discuss regarding the latest updates for Qatar Pro Metric 2024 and 2025 for lab technicians and lab technologists. So before starting the video, I would like to request you to please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Keep supporting me and let's get started with our today's vlog. So guys, um, I want to discuss regarding the latest updates of Qatar Pro Metric. So as you can see, for lab technicians and lab technologists, uh, the latest update is that uh, the syllabus is same and the marks are for 150 marks and the percentage is for 150 uh, MCQs, 150 marks and total marks 150 and with 150 MCQs and we don't have any negative marking here. Each question carry one mark that is you will be having total 150 questions for 150 marks and the passing marks uh, for the Khatar Pro Metric is 50 percent that is you should get at least 75 marks out of 150 to be get qualified and the uh, time you are having in this examination is 3.5 hours of time and uh, minimum you need one to two years of experience in your field to get qualified in this examination also whether if you want to go for a job you need definitely from your respective country you need one to two years of experience and mostly guys it is a cbt test that is computer based test for 3.5 hours and having 150 marks and this is the syllabus and in this syllabus include microbiology you will be having 30 mcqs and clinical chemistry also you will be having 30 mcqs Hematology also you will be having 30 MCQs, blood bank also 30 MCQs, immunology and serology both they will be including combined with 23 MCQs, histology and cytology techniques in this chapter also you will be having 7 MCQs. So these are the list of syllabus which you need to go very thorough to crack the examination that is 50% of marks you should get out of 150 you should get at least 75 so that you can be clarify clearing uh, cl clearing this exam okay guys so and one of the most latest update regarding this one is the guys who is holding bsc microbiology general and msc microbiology general can also uh, go through this exam they are also eligible for this exam but they should have at least two years of experience in their field and they should be able to crack this examination this Prometric DHP licensing examination to work as a lab technician or lab technologist in Qatar country. Okay, so this is the main update actually. This is the main update and I hope you like this vlog. If you are interested guys, please uh, just go follow all the syllabus, go through all the syllabus and um, I hope all the very best for you guys. So this is the latest update. Thank you guys.